Hello. Hi. How are you? How are you doing? Thank you so much for tuning in. Today's episode, actually, it's about receipt. Ibig sabihin, recibo. It doesn't matter whether you speak English or not. It doesn't matter what country you reside, whether you live in the United States, Europe, Asia. It really doesn't matter where you live. Money is money. Money has no language. Everybody can understand money. It doesn't matter how far the country is. They understand what is money and receipt. If someone handed you a payment, in return is receipt. It doesn't matter what country you reside. It doesn't matter what is your national origin. It doesn't matter whether you are a Christian or Muslim or Hindu or different religion. It doesn't matter. Receipt is a receipt and money is money. If someone handed you 1.5 million pesos, equivalent to $30,000, $555.90. That means business. That means that money is not a small amount. And that means receipt has to be given. There are no excuses about it. What do you think? If you think that I am right, receipt is very, very important when you pay a payment, then please, Kindly share your opinion below the comment section and engage with me. I want to know if someone handed you a payment, would you provide a receipt or no? Can you please help me to understand it? Because I have paid someone 1.5 million pesos but refused to provide me a receipt. Can you please tell me what is right? Because this is wrong for me. My own opinion is wrong. I handed and trusted to pay someone and the receipt should be given. And the contract should be given with the signature. There should be no excuses. It doesn't matter whether you speak English or not. It is mandatory to provide a receipt and contract with a signature. What do you think about it?